Catherine Manning with WHHI TV, and today we're at the Heritage, and it happens to be Youth Day, and we are having a putting contest over there. But behind me, you can see some of the practice rounds with the golfers coming up the back. So today is special because there's a program here that really inspires the kids to want to learn more about golf. We, there's just so much to do, so we're going to go investigate. I'm with Sir Willie. Hello, Sir Hello. Willie. <laughs> how are you? Very well. How are you? I'm fun. Fantastic. Well, you've been very busy with the kids today. Oh, Tell me about it. It's fantastic. It's Coca-Cola Youth Day here oh. at the RBC Heritage. Also, it's a plaid about reading day as well, where we had over a million pages read by local schools who participated in this event. And now, down here, putting with our real PGA Tour golfers. <laughs> reading is very important. It well. Is. Sir Willie, I wish you a wonderful time. Thank you for stopping by and saying hello to me. me. Thank you so much. You, you have a wonderful day and happy heritage. <laughs> Bye. Well, I'm with Charlie Roundtree and Joe Quick. Who, these guys are very much involved with the junior programs in South Carolina. Joe, tell me about the program and what it's all about with the Heritage. Yes, ma'am. Well, we've got a great partnership with the Heritage. They are the sponsor of our junior championship as well as our rankings throughout the state. We've got a bunch of our SCJGA alumni that have come through the program uh, that are going to be playing at the Heritage this week. Charlie, we we're just talking, you, some of the people who are playing here started in this program, right? Oh, Tell me the story. There's 10 or 12 of them out here today that are, have played in our tournament since they were that tall, like these kids from the Coca-Cola Youth Putting Day today. Um, DJ Trahan is going to be part of it. He's a uh, former Clemson All-American, played on the national championship team, the first one at Clemson. Uh, Wesley Bryan, who was the first winner from South Carolina, from Chapin, South Carolina. So we have a lot of kids. Kevin Kisner, who just won four weeks ago at the match play in Texas, the World Golf Championship. Just came from Augusta National, playing in the Masters with Tiger. Well, we're excited. We have a great day here at the Heritage, and uh, success to all of our young golfers. I'm with Biff Lathrop, who is the Executive Director, South Carolina Golf Association and Junior Golf Association. You got it, yep. So, you're here at the Heritage, and I understand by the 18th hole you have a tent to talk about your program. Tell me about it. Yes, we're very fortunate. Uh, the last few years we've been able to come down here to the Heritage and uh, have our tent that we've got on 18, uh, kind of telling the story of our South Carolina Golf Association, the things we do for amateur golf in South Carolina. Uh, we hand out t-shirts all week and have uh, all kinds of fun things for the kids and the adults and everybody in between, so it's fun. Your program across the state, how many kids or people do you have, juniors, I guess, uh, participating? Uh, in our Junior Golf Association, as members, we have about 1,800 kids in, in, in membership right now. But we have a multitude of events from the very beginners all the way to the championships for junior events. Uh, so it's a, it's a full scale. We do everybody th all year long and, and try, to, try to give them as many opportunities to play golf as we can. Well, congratulations and thanks for joining me. Thank you very much. I'm with Jackson and Carter who are standing in line for the putting contest and tell me Carter so you're excited about the putting what do you like about golf? I like watching golfers on TV Yeah. and how they hit so hard yeah I do too did you guys watch the Masters yesterday yes, did you see the ending where do you think? Tiger Woods. That's right are you excited about that? Yes. yes well guys I wish you a lot of luck in the contest okay. Look who I found. I have Derek Patton who is roaming all along. So tell me, uh, Youth Day, we're having a great putting contest today, but there's more to what's going on this week for the youth program. Tell us about it. That's right. Today is officially Coca-Cola Youth Day, but uh, in addition to that, for the rest of the week, uh, kids uh, and children un uh, that are 15 and younger mm -hmm. with a ticketed adult uh, get in for free. Mm -hmm. uh, and we just encourage a lot of uh, participation in the game of golf and come out and have some fun. I understand there's a youth zone too, which I'm excited about. I wish I could do the six holes and a putting green and someone can win what? That's right. We we, um, we have a, a, a youth zone um, and then a long putt, and everyone who, uh, who makes that putt is entered to win a, a set of golf clubs. Well, thank you for joining us. Thank you so much. I also want to mention about the youth zone, and that is really something fun for the kids. Over there, there's a course with six holes on it and a very big putting green for kids to pack it. So they want to encourage kids to play golf, and they want the family to have a wonderful experience here at the Heritage. Back to you.